In a strategic move to bolster Nigeria's tourism industry, the National Institute for Hospitality and Tourism recently held a specialized Train the Trainer program in Lagos. This targeted workshop aimed to equip journalists with knowledge and skill necessary to effectively report on the diverse facets of the tourism sector. The program acknowledged the growing need for well-informed journalists who can accurately portray Nigeria's tourism landscape. Omololu Olumoyua, president of the Association of Travel and Tourism Writers of Nigeria, spoke to journalists during the workshop. He emphasized how the training delved into various aspects of the industry, providing a comprehensive understanding of its structure, size and impact on the national economy. This newfound knowledge, according to him, will empower journalists to craft insightful and engaging stories that effectively promote Nigeria as a tourist destination. Globally, the attention is now being focused on tourism, and Nigeria is not being left out. And I think that is one of the main reasons why the president recently created a standalone ministry purposely to place Nigeria on the global tourism map. And looking at the disadvantages in the tourism sectors in Nigeria, this is being addressed by the two major agencies under the Federal Ministry of Tourism, that is NTDA, Nigerian Tourism Development Authority, and Na National Institute for Hospitality and Tourism. And these disadvantages now is one of the main reasons why NIOTO made it a point that there is need to train the trainers, to train the key stakeholders in tourism, to train even the tourism writers on how to further promote and project Nigeria. Under the new hope agenda, of the federal government. The government is trying to diversify the economy from natural resources to a, I mean, to a service economy. And tourism is one of the most profitable and sustainable service economy anywhere in the world. So the whole idea is to improve the competency of, person, of personnel and operators in the industry so that the quality of service that tourists and visitors receive when they come, in, come into Nigeria or any destination with, within Nigeria is going to be improved so that visitors are, are going to enjoy the experience and go back, share word of mouth, or we are going to experience increased patronage and return visits into Nigeria and every destination that Nigeria has to offer. An industry that is bringing a whole lot of resources into different uh, country. So it's hard to say that there's anything negative about it. But it's, it's an industry that uh, everybody, every government should look into and find their resources because uh, it's, it's going to be money spinning for everyone. The creating ambassadors, people who will go back to their locality and um, propagate this. Um, in, I learned recently that even Saudi Arabia um, budgeted billions of dollars to create another city close to what Dubai is today. So and I think Nigeria is not an exception. And um, every state in Nigeria has one cultural material to present to the world. Hence the reason why we're having this training. 